we uh, oppose um, the tier three proposal and we will not um, cave in to all of the pressure that's being applied uh, to us unless we can be given the clear evidence that we will not accept level three in its current uh, form. Um, and if the government insists that that is it and there's not, no further discussion, they will probably have to impose it. Um, I'm not saying that we would uh, in any way uh, ask people to defy it. Obviously, we respect uh, the law of the land, but it would be clear that it, it had been done in that in that way without our without our consent. And you know, there are, there is uh, an issue around around legal action. We, we put in this position where we're having to fight like this in the middle of a of a, of a national uh, pandemic. It should be whatever it takes. Let's get through this together. Get our focus back on fighting the virus. Um, but I'm afraid the way the government is handling this isn't, isn't allowing that. So I hope I've answered your question. It would have to be by imposition, not through uh, consent, but we are law abiding people. We would respect the law of the land, but we would consider other routes, legal routes, where we could uh, protect our many thousands of residents who are going to be uh, left in severe uh, hardship. Uh, in the run up to, to Christmas. We would not just leave them in the lurch, we would try and support them uh, and that would include any legal action we could take on their behalf.